Today I got called for airport standby, so I will be at the airport from 4.43 p.m. to 10.43 p.m. waiting to get called. I'm available for three days. I could be going anywhere, and since I don't know where I could be going, I'm gonna pack for all kinds of weather. So I thought that I would just show y'all before I go how I pack for standby. So first I've got my pajamas. I'm gonna bring some clothes to work out in just in case I get the time to work out on my layover. I could potentially not even go anywhere. I could just end up coming home tonight, but I'm packing for three days just in case. And then I'm gonna bring one shirt, a pair of jeans, a jacket just in case I go somewhere cold, a dress just in case I go somewhere where I can wear something cute, a pair of jean shorts, and then a bathing suit, which is wishful thinking, but you never know. And then I I don't like to wear my heels until I absolutely have to. Like I don't want to wear them driving or on the bus or anything. So I'm going to pack those in here and then that's about it. So I'm going to go sit at the airport for six hours and we'll see if I go anywhere. We're going to Madrid. <laughs> Yesterday on my way to the airport for standby, this happened. I didn't hit anyone else's car. Thankfully, I just backed my car into a column in my parking garage. I didn't even look at it until I got to the airport and then I took this picture. So I get to standby and I'm like feeling so bummed because I just did that and I'm feeling like an idiot. And I was looking up how much it was gonna cost to get it fixed. And I was just like, oh my gosh, like what have I done? And then crew scheduling calls, flight attendant Cassidy, I'm gonna have to give you a trip. And I was like, okay. And he was like, you're gonna be the number seven gate D36 going to Madrid. And I was like, <gasps> So here I am in Madrid and a crazy coincidence, one of my guy friends is here on vacation. And so I am gonna go hang out with him. So I just changed, I'll show you all the hotel room. And um, I didn't bring a purse because I just didn't think that I was going anywhere. So I'm gonna carry this around as a purse. But anyway, I'll show you all the hotel room and then we're gonna go explore Madrid. So you walk in and you have this little nook to throw your suitcase and stuff. And the bathroom is here. desk, the bed, I like this little nook too, TV on the wall, this window that doesn't open very far, mirror, and then my little coffee station, and I'm going to figure this one out tomorrow. From Madrid today our flight is gonna be like nine and a half hours going back to Dallas but I think it'll be fine the flight from Paris the other day was like so easy because there are so many services on that flight that it just flies by and we get a two-hour break so I'll get to like take a nap for two hours I'm actually kind of excited to go home um, and just have a few days I, I'm gonna have to get my car fixed 
So if anybody knows of somewhere in Dallas to get your bumper fixed, let me know.